Welcome back to Cake Fart World. Uh, let's get going. <laughs> All right, we're just leaning into it now. Oh, we are for this episode, and sure, I gotta have something. Anybody who's watched the series this far knows fairly degen, so. Oh yeah. <laughs> for for the dinosaur channel, a... especially like. Oh yeah, this is. I mean, you have. How many series do you usually have me? Well, the last series I was on the dinosaur channel was Arc. And that's when I'm like semi serious gamer mode because it's my yeah game. yeah. Also, Ark is just more active. Like you're running around doing shit. There's not as so much time to just riff. Whereas this, a lot of the time you sit back and just watch your little ant farm. Yeah. Uh, you know, use a dead long. Yeah, especially because we're out of like very bad territory can't word right now oh honey how are you just oh it's not they're not cleaning his room because it's not flagged as home uh oh the trades for gold the prison cell yeah yeah we never did that oh. okay manhunter pack coming in oh shit okay, yeah. Yeah, you can just shit. click and drag with that, oh. and you don't need to... What the fuck? Holy fuck. Uh, rockets? Maybe? Uh, they look like fucking demonic stuffed animals for a second, but that's just... Oh, they are Allosaurus. The, the head on. Yeah. 50 Allosaurus. Anybody wants an Allosaurus? They're manhunters, sadly. 50... 50 Allosaurus. They heard we have a, a Camarasaurus, and they're like, we want in on that. Okay, uh, so the only way they can get through from the top side is over here to the kill box. So I guess we should grab everybody and line up and bait them in ASAP. Mm -hmm. um, are we baiting, are we just going to set up in the kill box, or are we going to catch them for further out? Well, we're, we're setting up in the kill box. We're not fighting 50 Allosaurus in the field without turret backup. No fucking shot. Choke point, turrets, concentrated They're fire. not going for the kill box. They will when they can smell somebody. Okay. Jesus, they're fucking... Are you sure? Because they're going somewhere. Well, they're milling. Okay. Unless they're going to go smash this door for some reason, but they shouldn't do that. No, they're okay. just milling about erratically. Do make sure... Oh, they smell Eric and, and Nexith. Wait, we have a hole because I was putting an air conditioner in here. The wall is oh torn down and nobody built the air conditioner. Oh God. no! <laughs> emergency! We're, emergency! We're we're everybody, fucked. everybody report to the fucking gap in the wall. Can you get that could you get that wall built up? Not that uh, quick. We don't have the components probably. We don't have the bricks here to do anything else. This is we can choke point them. We hold them in the choke point, it doesn't matter. We just Thank you, Isorthus. Uh, fuck. Oh, man. Okay, well, this is, yeah. All hands on deck, everybody draft, everybody report to the gap in the wall. We're um, fucked. What can we do here? Maybe we can plug this real quick. Okay, I should have forbid that AC unit till the wall was built. I don't think about it. Uh, Wait, this is why I... to get I, 40 goddamn Allosaurs. 50. And, but this is why I was opposed to turning the kill, old kill box into a house. It was an oversight in construction. It's fun. Let's see. If we build this, who's And there? I also, also called them. I said, they're not just milling around. They're coming for something. No, you're they're right. You're them. right. It didn't... Uh, I mean, they, they do just mill around, but in this case... Can we just get out right. the door and quickly okay. catch up that spot? I'm sending Eats to try and do it. Yeah, you guys Aren't definitely the... need to get out of the fucking room right now. Draft up and get out. So Eats, I've sent to try and build a wall tile here outside the uh, spot. We'll see if we can get it done in time. Probably not, but we can try. Oh my god. They also might just bash on the doors because they'll have seen us and smelt us. So the biggest thing we can do is try to choke point them here and use this to our advantage. So we need to line up everybody right here in a big glob, basically. Uh, and then... Maybe have some body blockers here and unleash the animals. 
The animals will prop will go through the doors maybe though, so we might end up having them break through that way. You could uh, look, can't you just lock the doors? You know what? Maybe. Yeah, that might I mean, actually stop, stop the animals it, from going through. Yeah. We we just don't want our stuff opening the doors. No. That's all. Okay, everybody, I know it everybody lock them. drafted up except for Eats and Daisuke. Yeah. Uh, we should get Ileana. She is melee, so we should have her on emergency, like right in the front. Because she's the, she can be the final fallback if the animals all go down or something. They shouldn't. We should have plenty of animals, but. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Not going to get even close to it. Jesus. Yeah, yeah, they're coming in too fast. Okay. I'd say move so you're shooting down that lane at least a little bit. Yep. With uh, uh, Nexus and Eric. So they're coming like, in hot. So anybody there. who's nearby needs to like move up quick. Yeah, get get mm -hmm. right right up in line here. Oh, that's a lot of bodies. Oof. Yep. I'm also, I feel like, couldn't we make a run for the kill box or to lure them back that way, maybe? I don't know. I mean, not now. What about our heavy artillery? Is tornado generator worth it? Probably or is not. it too late? Yeah, we waited too long. I don't know where it is. It's in storage, isn't it? Nobody's carrying it. No, I think somebody's carrying it because it's on my uh, action bar right now. Somebody in my group has it for some reason. All right. Okay, Ileana needs to intercept that one that's through. We need to release all the animals immediately into combat if you're right here shooting. So all, all five of these people need the animals to be attacking. we got to intercept. All right, all my animals are set to attack freely. Okay. Make sure she gets her sword out. Oh, holy shit! Ileana dead. Yep. Yep. Bit her head right off? Wow. Okay, well, um, there it is. They're out. They're allosaurs. Try and not friendly fire the animals. Try and stay close. If we kill our own animals with bullets, that's the problem. Okay, pausing to reposition my first guys that are arriving here. What the fuck? Oh, I'm in the mist in the mix. I didn't even notice. I just kind of rolled up without even seeing myself there. Knuckle bones, animals attack, move back slightly. The meal. You can just sit there, it's fine. Green venom. Friend, where the fuck is green venom in this mess? Okay, just click on him on the top bar. Yeah, they got a uh, chewed on accidentally. We got the bottleneck. Mm -hmm. Okay, animals going down. Green Venom going to eye chewed out. We're going to have to queue up another one of those. That is done. I don't know why I'm doing that in the middle of combat. That's just how I'd play. Yeah, it looks like all of them coming in, though. Well, the body blocking is still doing really good. Oh, Daisuke tried to go in. That's really funny. Yeah, that's why I figured we weren't in that big of a trouble here. All things considered. <laughs> we have a dead person, man. I think that's trouble. Well, yeah, unfortunately, she immediately got one shot, so... 
What are you gonna do? I mean. I'll not send her into melee combat with uh, an Apex Therabod. Well, there was unfortunately nobody else was able to get here in time, so we had to have something try and stop them. If they, if they, if we wouldn't have been able to hold the choke point, if they would have made it through, we'd have been done. We would have wiped a fifty out. Are we? Place. Are we clear? Uh, mostly, but we should probably keep blasting. Um, I don't see any on their feet. I see a lot of dead bodies and a few. I mean, I mean, we need to make sure that they get put down. Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, you know, if anything else happens, but we can undraft. Thanks. I don't think we're not even going to have room for all these corpses. Yeah, we're going to do copy settings. We'll just chuck them back here behind the wall and fucking forget about them. I'm going to actually uh, delete this area here too and let these all get moved out. Well, Eric, you're a single man. Sorry about your wife. My condolences. That really yeah. sucks. And the cold snap. <laughs> Fucking cold snap, man. What the shit? Uh, Ileana needs to be buried. Where'd she end up? By the door. Yeah. Opening. Mm -hmm. Right there. What the fuck is she in this mess? I know, okay, right there, that exact dial. Prioritize burying Ileana. That'll help mitigate the mood penalties. We get her in the ground quick. Mm -hmm. Damn it, she had an 18 on animals. 13 crafting. <clears throat> that was a huge fucking loss. Yeah, unlike Woben, that one actually is a pretty big setback. Yeah, I agree. Nexus, then they're just slitting the throats of fucking Allosaurs. Uh, it appeared that he was cleaning blood. I'm not sure oh. why he was doing that. Yeah, cleaning blood. I don't know why this is the thing he wants to do. Okay, also a lot of fucking rot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, we need to make sure we don't get rot bomb, which should still be a thing in base game. I don't know how we're going to avoid it. That's a, that's a massive. Yeah. One thing we're doing is disallowing uh, these blueprints. <laughs> yeah, if, uh, if only the... Uh... Um, Where are you going with that next? Let's see here. If we do... Oh, some of them didn't rot, so we actually did get some meat out of this. Thing. Yeah, there, there were, given that there was 50 of them, I figured we were going to get some. Let's see if we can let the animals also help Paul, maybe. We'll just let the raptors and everything go up there temporarily. Yeah, the raptors should be the ones handling it for a couple uh, dromaeosaurids get uh, rot long. It's not as bad. Yeah. Also, some of the rots dissipated? Is that... Oh, because of the cold snap. Right. They're freezing. Mm. Now's the time to move shit. Yeah, look at the rot. It's all gone. We need to move them now. Okay, well, they're flagged to haul urgently, so it'll happen. In theory. Yep. 
Yep, the Dinons are working on it, thankfully. Oh, the storage is not flagged properly. They're taking eggs and proto mm. feathers. Oh, why did this get fucked up? What the fuck? I thought I copied and pasted this correctly. Uh, clearly not. Allow corpses. Allow only rotten. That's probably why nothing was hauling. Yeah. But yeah, we need to take advantage of this cold snap while we can. Yeah. There we go. You might want to allow that wall to be put back up. Some of it to be built. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like so that we, like leave one tile. Yeah, so they can haul things through. Yeah, but then, then we brick can close it up it ASAP. It up. We can also just straight up brick over the entrance point back in the back of the kill box too. Let's do that. Well, if anybody's gonna get an infection, at least it's an Argonian. Also going to haul the rice urgently because we need to get that moved over so that we can cook efficiently. Oh, shit. We got infection in uh, green venom. Needs a I tend just immediately. said that. Yeah, I didn't hear you. Eric, can you take care of it? He's sleeping. Got it. 67, solid. Bud. <laughs> the fucking Deinonychus. Wow, they just earned their keep big time, though. Look at that. Yep. That, yeah, that's all of them. Now we just need the walls finished. Mm -hmm. Well, Daniil's trying to earn their keep already, at least. Yeah, I'm currently tinkering with his uh, work schedule here, too, optimizing this a little bit. Eating raw. I'm uh, putting Daniil on cooking food here. Simple meals. You shouldn't fuck those up. Just give food poisoning. I th think the odds aren't that bad with his skill level. Our our herbivores are going to the old kill box to graze upon the the dead corpses, apparently. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. I love how much of the walls we fucking destroyed, too. We destroyed multiple granite oh, wall yeah. tile sections in that firefight. Damn. So can we can we wait on those and focus on the uh, wall that's going it, to? It's the secure. Rot? It's secure. Oh, for prevent the rot. True. Yeah, yes. we want the we want that wall finished before we get this other stuff. Yeah. Well, like I said, take advantage of the cold snap while it's going. We probably have enough time, but it's not bad to micro it. Oh yeah, and they're all back there now anyway. And here comes the rod again. Yeah. Fuck. There we go. Eric's on top of that shit. Okay. Uh, let's fix the zone. Well, he's probably getting himself rot lung for doing the best best for the colony. Probably shouldn't be doing that. We gotta get the wall in though. And just wall this shit up. You'll be fine, probably. Oh yeah, you're willing to risk Eric and his wife. 
definitely the message I'm getting. Right. Gonna have to. I would uh, probably make sure that you're inside the room rather than having to walk out <laughs> through the stink. We'll so see I, what happens when he finishes this next tile. Okay, okay he, he we're good. Go we're inside. good. Apparently. Now he's going to go up and around the stink to uh, finish the rooms, though. Apparently the stink play stays in here, which is shocking. I didn't know it works that way. I think it will stay in there for a little while. There's no, like, imagine it would eventually dissipate. Oh, this is also flagged a roof, which is... It's like, it's like, Jesse, you have lived on a farm. You know that stank just don't go away immediately. It's starting to dissipate now because, yeah, because the door yeah, was open. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, now we can allow. And the same, I disallowed the yeah, last two tiles yeah. on the they, exterior. They can't even get in there anyway, so we'll just ignore that till the bodies are skeletal, and then we can have somebody go in there and finish it up. Yep. Just for aesthetic purposes. It wouldn't be bad to actually have this room be accessible, too, for other carcasses that show up. That yeah, oh, just, definitely. Yeah, have a nice dumping spot. If anything, I'd say this uh, wall here now is, well, no, there's no roof on it, so it should still be able to escape that way, right? Yeah, yeah, there's, it'll 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 take care of itself eventually. I could um, also chuck Molotovs in there at some point, but um, I don't you want to, to touch it right now. It's better just to leave no, it walled you'd, up. Yeah, you'd be risking the rot. Yeah. All right. Well, considering how much I botched the construction plan, uh, we got away very easy <laughs> on that. Again, I wouldn't call Eric's wife being dead getting away easy. One colonist and eyeball. That's like nothing. It's his wife. Just because your wife is like <laughs> gallivanting around and riding every single rod she can find like it was a fucking oh, Harley Garrett's Davidson the one week. That took her. Come on, man. Just saying, he, he's so flippant about his wife running around, but Eric loses his significant other, and all. it's like, yeah, it's a not, nah, it's a trivial loss. Especially, I, I, I don't know, I'm feeling like we need a vote of uh, lack of confidence in our leader because it was his, your idea of you, like, yeah, set her up there, make her melee combat with fucking full, fully grown theropods. Listen, if you're gonna have a melee combatant, they gotta contribute. <laughs> Um, <laughs> I should have, uh, I don't know. I, 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 I stand by my, my decision. Oh, is, uh, Daniel still working? I, no, he's done. Oh, we can't see your stats anymore. That's a bummer. It's like melee. Yeah, sure. Melee, uh, a. a Compi or a, a Psittacosaurus Hypsilophodon. I, I, I think it's the right decision too, but some forethought on closing up whole Oh, yeah. Is... No, I, I a thousand percent <laughs> fucked be... up the construction plan by not making sure the back wall is built before putting in the cooler. 100% my, my fault in that sense. I think... Yeah, like a th every every time if I have a gap in the wall, I will throw everything I can to plug that gap to keep the enemies from breaking in. Like, yep. especially with how much shit they're throwing at us right now. I think it's, it's fully it's... possible that if Ileana had not intercepted that first Allosaurus, that things could have snowballed worse than they did. Maybe, but we had a couple Deinonychus there. Yeah. She wasn't alone on the front lines. The unfortunate part is that, yeah, that, that owl focused her for some reason yeah, when there were know. other melee Definitely. creatures engaged with it. Yeah, also just like, I think with the armor setting we have, effectively our necks are a weak point. And that's yeah. just, unfortunately, the way it works out. Mm. No, the dusters cover neck, actually. Mm. 
I mean, but they're still just a duster, and it's an Allosaurus. Oh yeah, no. Ultimately, yeah. The the, the fact that it was an Allosaurus was the primary thing that led to death. Yeah. Uh, the secondary is the the armor could have been better, but not that much better. <clears throat> I'm actually curious. I didn't check their stats while they were alive. I wonder what their their DPS is. It's probably pretty fucking high. Yeah, I am. Uh... A, I know. They are a desert and a couple other biome. They're a warm biome creature. So we're probably never going to get a shake at one. Mm -hmm. I, am a, I am an Allosaurus fan, so... The fucking Haxorus. Probably ideal, because can you imagine hap that happening all the time? I mean, I'm sure we could have the... Well, I hate to... Not trying to jinx anything, but have a, a 50 pack of UDs would be way worse. True. Their DPS is one of the highest of the theropods I've seen so far in the game because uh, they're higher than Rex's on DPS. Huh. Because Re Rex's, Rex's can be trained. Or something. Oh, no, no, they can be trained. Yeah, Rex's can fucking haul. Rexes become what I don't know how spinos compare, but yeah, Rexes are full advanced trains. I mean, it makes sense. I like people undersell uh, tyrannosaurs a bit, but for a dinosaur, they are one of the smarter ones. Like the whole right. the whole Silurosaurian lineage is enhanced brain size. Like tyrannosaurids, raptors, all of them. Yeah. So yeah, they are not to be trifled with. Oh, no. It's Dreams it's of, cool though. Dreams of Honey Gold told traits for gold about her value as a human. <laughs> they're they're she's just preaching the fake it till you make it because she's with us. <laughs> You're right. All us uh, heat banks. That that's why I'm surprised that more of these. Uh, the Argonians aren't trying to hook up with the... Well, I guess plenty of Argonians have hooked up with Chili. That's besides the point, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, that's just her thing. Yep. <laughs> She's just into it. Well, we could technically res Ileana, but I'm not inclined to, personally. <laughs> I don't think that's your call. <laughs> I know, it's not. Eric, well, do, do you want us to use fine. our one res on Ileana? No? I, okay. I, I can't. I can't condone that, no. Or no I can't that, say that's the right move. As long as we only have one, yeah, we save it for one of us. If me, you, or you go down, that's that's a different story. We And we've already all three came back from, like, like a quick breathe. We, were, we weren't totally dead, just mostly. Fucking Nexus. Just cleaning up the blood. God, can you think about how much blood that would be spilled from 50 dead, like, adult Allosaurs? Yeah. That would not be just like a, eh, we just clean up this room, it'll be fine. It's like, no, this room we give up on. The entire room <laughs> is now converted to being a fucking, uh, part of the graveyard. Whatever hopes and dreams you had of moving in here, Daniel, gone. Ooh, the Daniel... UDs are fertilized. I think that's our first Uteranus fertilization. Eh, no, I'm pretty sure we've had them before. Did we have eggs? I mean, look at how many UDs we got I, running I, around here. We got pretty sure... five, but I don't. I thought we tamed these all. I don't think we tamed all of these. Hmm. No, yeah, really animals have a social tab that shows their relations. Oh, we did tame those? Yeah, I don't think any of our Uteranus are related. Oh, so on the, can we see that on the Dionicus for their lineages? Yeah, if you go to their social tab. Okay, we have the one mature female. Yeah, she's got no kids. This is her first clutch of eggs, 30% progress. Oh, okay. Yeah, because if you click That's on a random dynamite, because you can see the sisters, nieces. Wait, how is sister comma niece? How does that work? 
story? Oh, it doesn't. Uh, unless how, wait, how is because... Rocket both Stumpy's sister, niece, and aunt? <laughs> what? I don't think that is physically possible, just no matter how much Alabama would try and make it. <laughs> I kind of like that I'm dealing with Ileana's loss by sort of hanging out with the Dinonicuses. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we should... Uh... Some kind of therapy. <laughs> we'll put her animals on Eric. Oh, Eric can't yeah. take can't take the Dynamica Zelda. That's right. Doesn't have high enough. We'll leave we'll leave Zelda unassigned. She can okay. wander. I'm going ahead and renaming the animals here too for future caravan adventures. That's at least, fun. at least my selection, just so I can Good idea. keep Holy track. Shit. Whole herd of protoceratops. How are we doing on? I guess with those owls, we should be going eat, right? Oh yeah, yeah, we're golden. Two full, two completely full baskets, and then some. Yep. Good Actually, the problem is our, our textiles again. Yeah, I was putting in some more uh, things. I don't pallets. think I ever set up the last set of pallets I put in. Yeah, the ones down south aren't set up yet. Oh, south. Oh, we need we need wood. That's what happened. Well, two of them are... Some of them are made. So. We still ran out of wood, though. I tried to make another one. It wasn't happening. Okay, I set up the two two bottom ones that are made there. Get the chem fuel out of the main stockpile. We don't need that place turning into a fucking inferno. Burn, baby, burn. Oh yeah, what did what did she? Oh yeah, she was melee, so she had a thrombo feather. Yep. So she didn't have a gun. Nothing missing there. Her skills. Well, as yes. she learned in the mountains. All right, I flagged a bunch of fully grown trees in the northern paddock to come down. Okay. How is Daniil doing? Cannot make better meals. It's fine. That ain't his job. Well, we're not exactly swimming in meals. We've got a, a stock, but it's not a great stock. What are you talking about? We have uh thirty nine. Yeah, that that's like a day's worth of food for the colony this size. I think it's more than that. Thirteen people, three meals a day, thirty nine. Oh, do they eat three a day? I actually don't know. I think so. I didn't think they ate three a day. I thought they ate like two. Maybe it maybe it's two. We need to get some of this goddamn... Yeah, these hides need to go. Good lord. Haul it urgently. Yeah, uh... We might want to just consider burning some of the textiles. Yeah, they're grabbing it now and getting it out of the way. Like, uh, if we're... You know, if we think the the raids are a little rough, <laughs> setting up an outdoor stockpile and just burning like all the fucking proto feathers or something would be like the thing to do. 
Oh, the proto feathers. Maybe the heavy dinosaur hide too. Are those well? That, no, because we can't replace that easily. Proto feathers are constantly replacing. Thirty-six. Well, the the armored hide is better. So like the I would never destroy the armored dinosaur hide or the thrombo fur, but like the proto feathers and the uh, armored dinosaur hide and the medium dinosaur hide, I think we could legitimately just fucking burn. Shouldn't we first uh, turn it into dinosaur sleeping beds instead of these little spots? We could if we want to go through the effort of doing all that. I'm I'm willing to just go and start it. Okay, but what I'm going to do, what I am going to do, is I'm going to set up an outdoor stockpile to burn some of these. We're just going to start with, like, the worst stuff. So we'll do proto feathers, and we'll, we'll do... we the worst with the most replaceable, because we're generating so many proto feathers. Mm -hmm. We have no use for medium and light dinosaur hide. Like, we have so much other stuff. It's literally spilling out the fucking doors. <laughs> So yeah, I'm making a burn pit in the cave uh, right here. We'll let the Dinonychus start hauling everything in there. And then I'm just going to chuck Molotovs in and we're going to fucking burn it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm also going to go through the benches. We're going to just turn off... Well, actually, it looks like I might have already basically turned off everything but the very best. But, uh, we'll be even more thorough. Dinosaurs, they can sleep. Oh, we have a bunch of dinosaur diseases. Shit. Can dinosaur or from can pet beds be walked over? I think so. I just I fucking love our courtyard here. Oh yeah, no, this was. The this was chaos. I know. I mean, it was just... It was what had to happen at the time. I get it. Fully. Fucking toxic fallout. I'm gonna go ahead and just batch play the Dinonychuses to follow, because there's a bunch that aren't assigned to follow right now. This one. I'm also hooking Daniel up with some more Dinonychus, more Dan Daniel Danielicus. The Dinonychus seem to grow pretty fast, which is nice. They make really good cannon fodder. Yeah, a pack of them has some very solid DPS, and it's so nice that they can haul. Very trainable. Yeah, they're they're. I guess I haven't good. checked their wildness. We haven't lost any, and we've been doing a good job at like training them up. So, either we've just have enough labor, or their wildness might not be bad, but. J5, J1, J2, J10. I need a, a new a new 3 and 4. Wildness is only 55%. Yeah, I don't know how that compares, actually, off the top of my head. I think uh, UDs are 80%, if I remember right. Let me yeah, check. that's not surprising.
Yep, 80% for a UD. Some other comparatives. Let's see what Trowdown, how does that sit? Probably even lower. Wildness, 20%. Yeah, Trowdowns are just, they're chill as fuck. Yeah, Camara Source, fifty percent. Your Styrax, your precious Styrax, forty five percent. Only ten percent difference between a Styracosaurus and a Dynamicus. All right. I think that's a good think... assignment. Oh, we got a few beds in. Oh, I see. Okay. I'm taking some from the uh, the, the, the burn bonfire. pit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Good. Doesn't need to all just burn. Like like I said, let's get it used first. Who? Jesse, where's your gun? I don't know. Where's where, It's in my pocket. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. Don't, don't worry about my actions. Well, I know what you're doing. You told us yeah. flat out how long ago. Is it's not a like a surprise. There's a bottle in his pocket. <laughs> I'm doing this for you guys. <laughs> Which clearly. Right. Not to satiate. Satiate his hidden uh, pyromaniac urges. Are... More than a little, I'm sure. Oh, why was Daniel making the vitals? Why is That's there. A... Did somebody, did something blow up? Oh, Daniil blew up a vitals monitor? Or what happened? What just popped? It, it, yeah, yeah Daniil failed, the... failed to Oh, the smoke pop, I threw smoke pop shells in there too. <laughs> yeah. The smoke pops went off, that's what it was, never mind. Okay. Yes, that's what it was. Uh, armor dinosaur. Been... We, we we, we're, not supposed to, we're not supposed to have those anyway, because we cheated, right? Oh, right, right, that's fair. That's, I completely on side of. We already sold a bunch of them anyway. Well, sold the... We made extra, too, though. Yeah. I'm pretty sure even before you cheated in the ones to make up, that... Oh, then it starts raining on your fire. Uh, this fire should be fully inside. Oh, Yeah. Okay. Which is why I built it here. We had this nice, nice open cave, nowhere for the fire to spread, mm -hmm. um, under the roof. Nice, nice burn pile. God, did you really have to burn all the downy hide, though? More will come. I mean, there's already probably more downy hide out on the map than there, just sitting on the ground. You find it, you tell me about it, because I have beds I want to make. It's probably better for the beds to be made as the hide becomes available than to make them all at once, because it's a lot of labor being tied up making beds for no reason. <laughs> Eric went and found some. Yeah, oh, see, the they're, wilds. Already, they're already delivering it. That wasn't from us, though. That was just random bundle laying on the ground in the south. I mean, it yep. probably was from us. I don't know. It's out there for a while, but... Wait, why is Trades for Gold locked in the back room? He know what he did. Is he allowed to move through this door? Apparently. I mean, he doesn't go anywhere, so... I don't even have trades for gold on my list. No, he's still a prisoner. Oh, okay, that explains it. Yeah, I'm just confused because he's... 
Let's hold this door open and maybe he can go to sleep. Yeah, he's sleeping on the ground. Yeah, yeah maybe he walked through while somebody else was doing something yeah, and got stuck. Be. Yeah, I don't know why we even put that door there. Eh, then we don't need to deal with all this shit back here in the cave. If somebody's going through the effort of smoothing the walls for the prison, then we don't want this whole section okay. of unsmooth cave here. It's pretty bad. Oh, that's fair, I guess. I was trying to make the space a little bit more accommodating, so that yeah, that's maybe fine. Might be more inclined to join us. It does improve how much they get off it. Yeah, you ain't wrong. Been so busy, Lara shit. That Without able so, to... if we have ideology, one of the expansions in, everybody has their own like you know ethos or whatever. And so, if you recruit somebody who comes from a colony that has a different belief system than you. You want to put them in a really shitty prison so that they have a real bad time and you can, like, basically brainwash them into your belief system easier that way. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I see. They'll, they'll lose faith in their belief system quicker if they're in awful conditions. Oh, okay. Now, is ideology purely spiritual, or can you... Are there it, agnostics and stuff? Yes. It, ideology is a vague religion-slash-social structure like um philosophy system you, you can you can have ideologians that are like meritocracies that, that they can be religions they can be oh. cults they can be whatever kind of like organizational scheme you want your colonists to believe in and follow it's pretty pretty broad uh, after you opened up the pemmican they started feeding it to animals that's fine. We only had like one stack forbidden anyway, so it wasn't worth the effort of like microing anyway. Oh shit. Uh, fire. Yeah, that was one we need to deal with. That's right by the generator. That's bad. Mm hmm. Uh, grabbing green. And Ch Chili was fucking cloud watching, so she's in. Shinto's uh, close, I'll grab in too. Ne Nexith. Yeah, we should need more than like three or four people to stamp this one out real quick if we get that. Right, just a matter of getting out. there is the important yeah. thing. Okay. Yeah, I never thought about it, but it might be worth putting um, concrete around these. Just as a oh, preventative so... measure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, might as well stop fire spread. I'm down. For sure. Yeah. Although, that probably have less of a chance to put them like, getting hit by a, light, by a lightning or something. Maybe harder to get it to them to fix them and stuff. Well, concrete is the floor type. Oh, okay. Yeah, that so makes sense. The, so the fire, for sure, yeah, yeah. That, yeah, for sure. That makes complete sense. Got an our fire way up here, but I think that one's going to be fine. I think that the only thing that's going to suck is losing the uh, the trees since we're not doing great on wood. We also talked about expanding to another generator or two. I don't remember where they were. The other. Uh, right here. That's the big one. That's the easy yeah. one. What'd you pick? Over here. Oh, right. One there. I think there's another close one. Yeah, I, th I thought there was one on the other side of the map that was close. Oh, yeah, there is. There's one, one here, too. Oh, uh, that's, that's on the uh, kill box side. So maybe not that one. That's fine. Advance what? Oh, he's... He is super he's... malnourished. Yeah. We ain't been feeding him for some reason. Uh, yeah, I guess yet. Warden's been too busy. If if all Wardens are also cooks and we're behind on food, that might be part of that. Yeah, I'll bump I imagine they're up. very low on the list for food. If, uh... For low. Yeah, it's, uh... Not going to be a priority for somebody to go feed the prisoner versus themselves. Right. 
So I'm going to prepare extensions, I think, for both of these generators. Because we can't build the generators right now anyway, so we might as well just, you know. Oh, although right. it looks like with uh, his bad mood, if we just avoid him, we're fine. Because he's berserk, it said. Maybe? He'll eventually collapse from starvation, which would be fine. Yeah, so let's disallow the doors so nobody goes in there and he doesn't have punch yeah that works i'll just i'll keep an eye on him so when this does happen we can go yeah good make him yeah i mean we should get the uh the notification for the uh flaps i think well i mean isn't there a possibility he comes out of the berserk state ah uh, maybe frankly i don't remember he's at 66 percent malnourished I mean, he'll definitely come out of when he fucking collapses. Yeah, he's just uh, pacing back and forth menacingly. Yeah. That's forbidden. Oh, time? About 52 minutes on this episode. Oh, okay, not as bad, because we went so long before. It's like after the super exciting previous episode. <laughs> that went long so we could talk boys spoilers. Yeah. And just boys. We talked boys a lot, too. like it was a regular old-fashioned little girl's sleepover talking about cute boys right. <laughs> like carl urban yeah, i was gonna say which boy which boys is the cutest <laughs> i mean if we're talking actual i think you gotta go uh huey uh, the gentleman's like cute? steak huh <laughs> for some reason i said a gentleman's steak <laughs> i mean i'm just going legitimate because Carl Urban, Carl Urban is not cute. He True. Is, yeah. He is handsome or dashing or sure. you know when he's not when he's not in Billy mode, but like just as a as a person. Oh, oh, he's down. He's out. The boy's done. Okay, you are on top of it. And I can't I can't speak for Anthony Starr because this is the first thing I've seen him in. I'm not familiar with him when he's not just Homelander. Uh, is anybody going to rescue this guy though? Oh, I I didn't know I was supposed to be doing that. Uh, let's I was have, just watching. I'll have next let's go capture him real quick cuz he's right there. And then maybe somebody will have to come feed him, but Yep. Like hitting up dreams. That's so bizarre. I'll prioritize feeding him. Okay. Yeah, definitely the warden should be the one to do that because it might help build rapport, however that works. Yeah. Why? Uh, I fucking. Whoa. I kind of hate that we have these little. these things. Because my guy will cross the entire compound to go relax socially in these rooms that serve no purpose. Oh, these like little, the little front room here on this building? Yeah. Yeah. They don't, they don't make the person who lives there's sure. mood any better because the room isn't part of the, like, the quality uh, of their yeah. bedroom. So the upside is, like, they will wake up and want to eat the meal that they slept with in their pocket, right? And they'll eat it sometimes in their bedroom because there's no table nearby. And they'll get the eight without a table debuff. That's why I like so, to give every bedroom a table. Okay, so give the bedroom a table, not the... 
Well, but I mean, you, you wouldn't eat, you wouldn't have a table in your bedroom for eating. You would have it in a nice little dining like, room, right? Like right you don't front. know me. I would have some <laughs> fucking. Little, I I won't eat in my bed, but I'll eat at the desk at in my bedroom all the time. I don't bother mm-hmm. me. No, I mean, I just I, aesthetically, I I like the dining room, like little dining room in their little houses. Yeah, but it's it's not working for our compound layout because our it's not just they, my character. They will go relax my... socially in whatever random dumb spot they want to. They'll find a chair or whatever and do it. I I don't know if they can use one that's at like a work room, but they might. They'll also go for walks and do other dumb shit socially. So like, it, it's hard to stop it, you know. They'll find something stupid to do, trust me. And stop it. You can only hope to contain it. Okay, we have 58 proto feathers in the burn pile. We have more beds queued up, though, so I won't burn it. I'll let it sit. Look at me, the benevolent overseer. Yeah. I'm a generous god. <laughs> Baragon, what's the matter? Oh, we got the... Lou's got the flu. Gotcha. I dream of a day when the stockpile doesn't have textiles. Oh, also, I noticed the chem fuel has overflowed fully into the workroom. This is a situation that cannot be allowed, because that will burn this shit to the fucking ground. <laughs> So I'm going to expand the chem fuel storage shed further. Well, maybe we didn't have a pyro in our midst. Just lighten everything the, up. We are, we are flirting with disaster, actually, in the storeroom, having chem fuel and rocket launchers together. <laughs> how, how are those going to... That's... What's going to happen? How's that going to happen? Do you, want me, do you want me to show you? <laughs> also, do you really want to block this off entirely? I feel like that, or I feel like that's a good, well, I guess it's not that big of a shortcut. It, it's not that big of a, yeah. Okay. I think it's fine. I was just, I was just thinking about the, like, if people are walking on the pathway and or in between or much, but I don't, there's definitely trackways there. People have been. Like, oh yeah, there's... they'll cycle through, but part of it's the animals and it's, and it's under a roof here, which is why it stays filthier for longer. So. Oh, right, right. I forgot we roofed it. Why do we still have a roof there? Uh, well, for one, we don't want lightning to hit the shell. Oh, gotcha. Well, no, the shells, yeah, but I meant over here. Uh, uh, I think this this roof over here, this was just left behind because okay. the only reason this roof is left here, I never bothered to remove it all. Okay. You can remove it if you want. I just didn't see It'd the be... point. Yeah. Let me try. Okay, we got component production going. Have we got any more artificial parts made? It doesn't look like it. I'm not shocked. We did get the vitals monitors. I don't know if you guys noticed that. I queued those up. We got yeah, a nice I, well, I see it because Den Daniil failed that one and cost us some components. Oh, true, yeah. That fucker. <laughs> that fucking new guy. I like how we're like, yeah, we're gonna keep the rain off our shells for deterioration, but the uh, the mortars themselves, this big circular tube pointing emptily towards the sky, <laughs> yeah. that that's that's fine. Yeah, well, I mean, sure. they can't be roofed, so that's just what it is. No, I know in game, but it's just a funny right. image to me of like, I I I know in like real life you wouldn't have them. Yeah, oh, trades wow. is trades is in. Wow, that went really fast. Did somebody have inspired? I don't think so. No, he, the old-fashioned okay. way. I think trades is is Eric's new wife. So here you go. Eric. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's a twenty-two-year-old male Argonian, but you know what? <laughs> you gotta make do. It's the uh, <laughs> the the new guy bit of like. It's a lot like high school. Uh, let's see what we got for the weapons. So for the sex weapons... you want, you can't get. The sex you can get you don't want <laughs> I would say you can give him uh, one of the regular assault rifles out of the stockpile for a gun You're in... oh yeah, I suppose and I will uh, 
You can make him a house wherever you see fit, I guess. any good assault rifles now is not the time to social fight uh normal assault rifle i said good i oh. meant normal uh, you might yeah oh our argonians fought each other over what the girls are fighting in the greenhouse yeah what did they what are they fighting Im for? implied or uh, insulted their eloquence now what? they're talking about getting drunk that's yeah good for you eats. I don't know. Eats just being a bitch. Eats and oh, dreams it's... social thought. That's what we're talking about. I, uh... Eloquence. That eats, loves, kills, said dreams of honey and gold, uh, is a mumble rapper, and dreams of honey took exception to that and went into a fit of rage, and she said she's not a mumble rapper. She is straight, dirty south. Luda. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're looking right sure, at each other sure. in the hospital. <laughs> and, that, and that that's go look at the social tab. That story is like easily figured out there. Oh no, like, I, I was <laughs> commenting more on the mumble rap part of me not well, yeah, knowing cause... nothing about mumble rap. Oh, okay. Oh, have you ever have you ever seen the Lonely Island or heard the songs, I guess, of Shy Ronnie? Yes, yes. That's basically mumble rap. But I can I could see how that would be labeled as such. I understand that. Yep. I've been gifted. That's that's knowledge. not even that's that's still I'm still doing a bit though. That's not like a real it's not as simple or as bad as that. Like it's. Uh, I'm giving like, trades for gold. A house. Yeah. Or home. Okay. For now, he's in a tent, but you can uh, hook him up with some domicile. A a domicile. I don't know why I pluralized it. Mm -hmm. Here we are. I'm going to slap a granite door on the corpse pile. That way I can chuck Molotovs in there and burn it out every now and then. That's fine. Good idea. Mm -hmm. There's plants in there that the animals could eat, though, too. Yeah, I'm going to let the animals in there wholesale, too, because then the Deinonychus can uh, help move Hull shit. shit, yep. They're our best haulers. They, ain't, they don't give a shit about the dead bodies. They're more like, you guys going to eat that? Yeah, it's actually... Like, legitimately, one of their best uses is hauling corpses away. I don't know why I was keeping them out of the chem fuel originally, too. That didn't really achieve much. Mm -hmm. I, because that room hasn't always been for chem fuel. Maybe? Maybe that's it. No, a hundred percent. That room. I think that was our original butcher table, or and or oh, kitchen even. Maybe, yeah. That's why okay. it's got the tile in there. Oh, that would make sense. Yeah, actually, I think you're right. Yeah. Yeah. Of I was thinking I'm about. Right. I was thinking about the always... tile myself when I was uh, expanding. I was like, why is part of this? Why is this tile? It's... Yeah, I'm the one who slaved away over that fucking stove. Back in the day. Yep. Granite. Okay. Ooh, you know what else we can do? We open up this whole fucking area back here. We might as well the animals into it. Oh yeah, just the new zones. Hell yeah. Not that they really need it too bad. Now, I mean, it's it's different when we have cold snaps and shit like that that fuck us over. Well, we can also uh, have the Dynanicus haul this steel out of here. Because it's safely behind a wall. Right. They can haul the wood and stuff back, too, when we're out there generating lumber. <laughs> 
interesting strategy with the the expansion to the uh, to the new power source. Yep. Well, I learned my my lesson not to put a hole in the wall. <laughs> well, not that. I mean, more like just this little column of like whatever. Like. Oh yeah. Just... I, I've done. I've gone to immense lengths putting in a fucking three tile corridor like this to a generator on a map before just to get more power. I, I've I've snaked like across the entire map to every available spot or colony. That's I mean, like my a quarter of the my size idea, of ours. Right. No, my idea would have been. I would have done just this the wall out like you are, but then connect this one like that, and yeah, then you have, you just increase the size of your pen like massively. True. Yeah. Actually, especially for this one, just building it over to here if we can would have saved bro uh, blocks a little bit. Yep. Too late now. Fuck it. I mean, it's not completely done yet. Yeah, I suppose, like, we've got to, I don't know. I mean, you could also expand it to the south similarly, because it's about as far to that one down there. And, like, so you could, it's like a slippery slope argument. Well, why don't we just add all of this territory to the area? And maybe we should. Why don't we just expand the wall through here and here and here and add all this territory to the animal area? Maybe I mean, we should. Eventually. But, like, eventually. Yeah. Not right now. But this one is, like, right there, and it's right next to it. This wasn't like a, a, a nebulous thing. This is this was just a. We're just gonna wall her out. All right, there you go. It's happening. There you go. And you don't have to take down the wall around it either, because the uh, the anti fire me uh, point is still valid. Yeah, I'm actually, gonna expand the wall all the way over here. I think is better. Okay, that's fine. Mm. I just put, I, that's why I only put the planning thing and I didn't put the build here, yes. Yeah, oh, we're way over on time again this episode. Well, that's a perfect spot to end on. Uh, until next time.